This video is about the basics of principles of resistance exercises. The three foundation stones of resistance exercise are overload principle, set principle and reversibility principle. Overload principle states that if muscle performance is to improve, a resisting load that exceeds the metabolic capacity of the muscle must be applied. It means muscle must be challenged to perform at a greater level than it is accustomed to. For example, if you can lift 10 kg weights very easily, then you must lift 15 kgs or more to get the benefits of the training. Set principle or specific adaptation to imposed demands principle states that body systems adapt to stresses placed on them over time. For example, if you are someone who hasn't performed a split ever and you try to stretch your legs apart to perform it, you do it consistently by the end of the month, you will be able to perform the split. This happens because your legs get accustomed to the frequent stretches and so it can perform the splits. Elements of set principle Specificity principle states that training should be task specific and goal specific. This is a very popular advertisement that depicts the specificity principle very beautifully. Here a grandfather is performing few exercises so that he can perform his ultimate goal that is lifting up his granddaughter so that she can put the star on the Christmas tree. Next element of set principle is transfer of training which is also called overflow principle. It states that training effects are at times observed in non-training parts or gives results other than goal which can be a positive effect or a negative effect. A classic example of it is the face of weightlifters while they lift the weights. If you observe properly, you will see their facial muscles are tightened. This happens because of transfer of training. While their arms muscles are contracting, it gives a transfer of training towards their facial muscles due to which their facial muscles also contract while their hands are doing the work of lifting the weight. Reversibility Principle It states that Stopping training will reverse all the improvements in the body. As the picture clearly says, if a bodybuilder stops training for a long period of time, as long as 2-3 to three months, then the muscles will lose their tightness and the improvements will be lost.